Coming to you live from the JJBA Fashion Show in the lovely New York City is Import Legacy. Today, I, Emerald, am joined by... I hate this job. And we're talking about another episode of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. JoJo, hands down, is the most fashionable anime to date. When talking about JoJo's impact on fashion and vice versa, it's like watching a cultural tennis match. Fifteen love! This is the start of the cultural tennis match. Each character's clothing speaks so much about the characters and their setting. For example, take a look at these two characters from part 4, Diamond is Unbreakable. Josuke Higashikata and Kira Yoshikage. This part of Jojo takes place in 1999. And you can already tell by the overgelled pompadour Josuke has, don't tell him I said that, and bagginess of Kira's suit, this is definitely the 90s. Dude, we gotta talk about the names, the character names! Oh, oh, right, right, right. When people say everything's a Jojo Bizarre Adventure reference, they aren't lying. Some of the character names are famous fashion brands and designers. There's people like Guess, Dolce & Gabbana, and Versace. Talk about product placement. Who are, Who are you? you? I'm Natalie. She poses! She poses! So, I heard there's a cultural tennis match. I'm ready to play. So, wonder how JoJo gives back to fashion? The best answer would come from Gucci. Hirohiko Araki has had several collabs with Gucci from advertisement campaigns, Gucci JJBA spin-off mangas, and even official Gucci JoJo merchandise. Araki has drawn spreads for Gucci, for Spur Magazine, and a spin-off manga called Jolene Fly High with Gucci, starring Part 6's protag, Jolene Kujo. There's another spin-off manga starring Rohan Kishibe of Part 4 called Rohan Goes Gucci, and also a Gucci-sponsored art gallery in Florence, Italy. In addition to numerous collabs with Gucci at the Japan Original Beauty event, a makeup artist by the name of Tadashi Harada, Harada did a photo shoot with models depicting high fashion versions of Jojo characters. Wow, that's cool! Very, very cool. Yes, and that, my friends, is the power of Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. See you next time on Import Legacy, where we talk about the musical influences of Jojo.